we've had this mud skipper for coming up on a year now and it's an interesting but probably 90% of the time pretty boring animal so it's a good thing that it's tanks pretty nice looking what we got it in is just a 20 long with a fluorescent light off of, I think it's off a of 10 gallon that I had I just made a little Lexan hanger for it so it kind of holds it up and makes it look like it's floating and then we've got it with some uh, sand and a little bit of uh, organic mud or dirt like potting dirt it's, uh, or earthworm castings is what it actually is and then it's actually a brackish water so I just use some salt from my salt water setups and then we've got some mangroves growing in it and they grow pretty good we got eight or ten in there some of them do it better than others but they've been staying alive for a while all we really do for care is just top it off a little bit of a water change from time to time it's not really a whole lot of water in there it really hides most of the time when we're in the room kind of cl crawls under the heater way back here and uh, he's got himself a little hole where he can see us but we can't see him and all we really do is feed him every other day we feed him uh, mealworms or crickets we do a couple times a week and that's pretty much it I've fed him shrimp before but he really prefers alive and then we just every day we missed all the mangroves because they seem to grow better when you do that and one I think the main reason that misting helps because if you look at them when they're growing, like this one, it's a little bit of brown on here, it, it sheds off, and then the new leaves grow. So I think getting it wet, keeping it humid, helps that uh, peel off easier. You can kind of see it just did it on this one. Sometimes I'll actually go in here and peel it off for it. Just easy as that. And then it just grows a new layer of leaves and keeps going. Some leaves grow nice and big, some stay small. I think it all depends on where it is in comparison to the light. And actually, I probably need to raise the light on these. But, I have taken a video, I set up a camera, and it actually shows him coming out and hunting crickets and eating them, so I'll t put that at the end of this. Thanks for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe, and keep me doing more videos, and hopefully I'll get better as time goes. Thanks for watching.